Start with Katie on your left. Uh, for Ryland, that first three you hit, I think with about nine minutes left in the second half, that kind of sparked your run. Um, kind of what were you feeling in that moment? How did that kind of fuel you for the rest of the game? Uh, it just it felt good. So the rest of my shots after that felt good. So yeah, that's it. That's about it. All right, Aaron. Yeah, for Aaron, what what happened with the kind of altercation with you and, and Robinson and just on the bench with, with Nate? What, what was your vantage point from that? Um, we just, you know, just we was just competing, honestly, and kind of just got into it a little bit worse. So it wasn't nothing like crazy. It's nothing that was going to be taken off the court. We was just competing and going at each other. Do you like seeing your head coach kind of make a, a move like that and kind of have your back like that? I mean. That part, I didn't see what my coach did. I thought you were talking about just the exchange of words. Yeah, I understand, but the second part of that, you didn't see what they did. No, no. In the back with Chase. A question for Aaron. It, it, it looked like he got caught in the nose tonight. I think maybe two, three games ago, he got caught in the nose again. Uh, what happened? And and was it uh, uh, was was it painful or no big deal or what? I mean, yeah, it was painful, but you know. What we preach here, blue collar, play hard, play through, you know, everything really. So a little bit of contact and stuff when I'm crashing and getting in there, it's not going to affect me too much. Remind me which, which game you got popped in before? It was Vanderbilt. Keep it in the back. Rylan, uh, what did Coach Oates say to you around mid-second half that got you going? He came to the bench and told me, you, you got to get going for us if we're going to win this game. So. Uh, he was talking mainly on the defensive end, so I got to go in there and it opened up my offense. Any other questions for these two? In the front with Joe. Uh, just for both of you guys, could you address uh, the crowd this evening? Greg Byrne and the, the Alabama Athletics announced to you at the 16 minute mark. Everybody can come down. Did you have any reaction or did you notice the crowd difference tonight? Yeah, I noticed the crowd, they get packed. I, I appreciate everybody, all the students that came and all the non-students that came. Like, we need that type of energy uh, every single home game. That's so we have the home court advantage as part of the advantage, the fans. So appreciate them coming out, and you know, we're going to need them every game. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.